Six Different Ways You Are Keeping Yourself Single Christian Dating Counsel Figuring Out the Excursion of Singleness Singleness can frequently be a perplexing and diverse excursion, especially inside the domain of Christian dating. Numerous people face a bunch of difficulties and misinterpretations that can cause exploring this way to feel overwhelming. From cultural tensions to individual assumptions, the experience of being single is frequently loaded down with questions and self-question. It's significant to perceive that being single isn't intrinsically negative, yet rather a chance for development and self-disclosure. In this video, we will investigate four explicit ways people may be unexpectedly keeping themselves single. By inspecting these ways of behaving and designs, perusers can acquire significant bits of knowledge into their own dating process. The point is to cultivate a more profound comprehension of oneself and to empower a more purposeful way to deal with Christian dating. Through self-reflection and an eagerness to roll out certain improvements, exploring the way of singleness with effortlessness and purpose is conceivable. 1. Holding Unreasonable Assumptions One of the critical deterrents in the domain of Christian dating is the presence of ridiculous assumptions. These assumptions can originate from different sources, like media depictions, social stories, and, surprisingly, certain translations of Christian lessons. The impact of rom-coms, fantasies, and glorified romantic tales frequently drives people to imagine an ideal accomplice who meets a thorough rundown of measures. This can set an unreachable norm, making a boundary to framing veritable associations with genuine, flawed individuals. To explore this test, changing assumptions while keeping up with elevated expectations is fundamental. Perceive that everybody has defects, and that a fruitful relationship is based on figuring out, split the difference, and development. As opposed to zeroing in on shallow characteristics, focus on values like generosity, confidence, trustworthiness, and a common obligation to God's lessons. Look for God's direction through supplication and reflection, requesting insight to perceive a reasonable accomplice who lines up with your confidence and values, regardless of whether they live up to each hopeful assumption. By re-examining assumptions and zeroing in on the main thing, Christians can develop more reasonable and satisfying connections, encouraging associations in view of common regard, shared confidence, and certifiable love. 2. Feeling of Dread Toward Weakness Weakness is a fundamental part in the groundwork of any significant relationship. It is the readiness to free oneself up to another, to share one's deepest contemplations, sentiments, and encounters. Nonetheless, the apprehension about weakness can frequently prompt profound walls that avoid expected accomplices as much as possible. This dread normally comes from a firmly established worry of getting injured, dismissed, or possibly feeling deficient. Moreover, embracing weakness implies figuring out how to offset receptiveness with insight. It is vital for share one's heart with the individuals who have exhibited dependability and regard. Ephesians 4.2.3 encourages adherents to be totally modest and delicate show restraint, holding on for each other in adoration. Really bend over backward to keep the solidarity of the soul through the obligation of harmony. This section features the significance of persistence, modesty, and tenderness in encouraging trust and solidarity inside a relationship. Fundamentally, by confiding in God's arrangement and embracing weakness as a strength, people can break down the close-to-home walls that thwart the improvement of significant connections. Figuring out how to open up in a solid and adjusted manner considers further associations and prepares for enduring, satisfying organizations. 3. Focusing on profession or individual aspirations over connections. In the present quick-moving world, it's normal for people to focus on their vocations or individual aspirations over heartfelt connections. While self-awareness and expert achievement are significant, an overemphasis on these areas can accidentally sideline the quest for significant heartfelt associations. This unevenness frequently prompts botched open doors for fostering a satisfying relationship. At last, finding a harmony between vocation desires and close connections is about purposefulness and focusing on the main thing. By putting forth a cognizant attempt to coordinate dating into your bustling life and looking for God's direction, you can seek after your own and proficient objectives without compromising the chance for a satisfying relationship. 4. Negative self-discernment and absence of certainty. Negative self-insight and an absence of certainty can fundamentally influence one's dating life, frequently prompting delayed singleness. These sentiments can originate from various sources, including previous encounters, cultural tensions, 
and individual frailties. For the majority, past connections that finished inadequately or occasions of dismissal can install a profound insecurity. A cultural principles and media depictions likewise frequently set unreasonable assumptions, encouraging a conviction that one should look or act a specific method for being considered deserving of affection. Eventually, developing self-esteem and acknowledgement is foremost in drawing in and keeping up with sound connections. At the point when you love and acknowledge yourself, you radiate a positive energy that normally draws in others. Certainty turns into a magnet, attracting people who appreciate and regard you for what your identity is. Building major areas of strength for enough self-esteem improves your dating possibilities, as well as lays the basis for enduring and satisfying connections. 5. Scriptural Viewpoints on Singleness and Dating The good book offers significant experiences and direction regarding the matters of singleness and dating, giving solace and bearing to those exploring these seasons. One key sacred writing is 1 Corinthians 7 35 where the missionary Paul talks about the benefits of singleness. He underscores that the unmarried can give themselves completely to the ruler's work, liberated from the interruptions that frequently go with conjugal obligations. This viewpoint urges single people to see their status not as a lack but rather as a chance for profound development and administration. For those feeling the heaviness of singleness, the holy book offers comfort and insight. Philippians 4, 6, 7 encourages devotees to introduce their solicitations to God through supplication and thanksgiving, promising the tranquility of God that rises above all comprehension. This affirmation can carry solace and solidarity to single people as they explore their dating process, advising them that they are never alone and that God's arrangements for them are loaded up with trust and commitment. 6. Viable Moves Toward Defeat Singleness Hindrances Addressing the boundaries to finding a significant relationship requires a complex methodology. Putting forth reasonable dating objectives is significant. It is critical to comprehend that finding the right accomplice is an excursion, not a race. Begin by characterizing what you look for in a relationship and guarantee these objectives line up with your Christian qualities. Being clear about your assumptions helps in distinguishing viable accomplices and evades superfluous frustrations. Supporting fearlessness is another fundamental stage. Certainty originates from a solid mental self-portrait and self-esteem. Participate in exercises that you appreciate and succeed at, which can upgrade your confidence. Moreover, look for criticism from confided in companions or guides to figure out your assets and regions for development. Keep in mind, certainty is appealing and can essentially affect your dating experience. In conclusion, looking for mentorship can give important direction. A tutor who comprehends your confidence and relationship objectives can offer bits of knowledge, backing, and support. They can assist you with exploring the dating scene with a grounded point of view, guaranteeing your activities line up with your qualities. By making these proactive strides, while staying patient and confiding in God's arrangement, you can defeat obstructions to singleness and draw nearer to tracking down a satisfying relationship. Embracing the excursion with confidence and trust the way to finding a satisfying relationship frequently requires contemplation and the readiness to perceive and address individual boundaries. All through this blog, we've investigated multiple ways people could coincidentally keep themselves single. By recognizing and conquering these snags, one can open up to the conceivable outcomes of a significant, religious relationship. It is fundamental to recall that every individual's process is extraordinary, and embracing this excursion with confidence and trust is crucial. Confiding in God's arrangement permits people to push ahead with certainty, realizing that their encounters are essential for a more prominent reason. While the street may some of the time appear to be testing, having confidence that God has a special arrangement for every one of us can give the strength and support expected to persist. Eventually, the excursion to finding love is basically as critical as the actual objective. Each step taken in confidence carries you nearer to the relationship God has planned for you. Remain confident, remain dedicated, and recollect that you are never alone in this excursion.